All right, Shalom, Shalom. This is Brother Dunya Allah coming back with another lesson, giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Racha HaKodash. Double honor to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, and Shalom to the hopeful elect -like brethren who are teaching and pushing this word in sincerity and in truth. Shalom. So, yeah, um, Hey man, I'm you know just out doing deliveries or whatever, and uh, basically you know just wanted to you know do a do a little in transit uh, through the spirit, man. You know just flowing in the spirit, in transit through the spirit, and um, it's an impromptu, and I'm gonna try to quote as many scriptures as the spirit give me, uh, you know to talk about, you know, um, yeah. And uh, so lucky if you hear the GPS in the background slightly. Hopefully it's not too loud. I turned it down a little bit. All right. So lucky I don't want to check my phone. But um, yeah. Uh, hey man, the, the time is fastly approaching for the return of our Lord Yahweh Shai. And, uh, you know, hey, different uh, brothers and sisters have been having dreams of prophecy, man. You know, having different dreams of prophecies coming to pass, different things coming to pass, you know, different visions, man. Because the Lord can... Because the Lord can basically, you know, He can send you uh, visions and, and, and of His will. Uh, which is his pleasure that he wants to do upon the earth and send you a vision for you to see what ha what's going to happen before it happens now this is how the lord spoke unto the prophets back in the day all right the prophets of uh, uh were revealed by visions and dreams okay now that's written in uh, numbers chapter 12 and verse 6 you know, if, if the Lord will make himself known unto someone, all right, he will do it in a, a dream or he'll do it in a dream or in a, uh, a vision, you know? He'll reveal himself unto a prophet, or as they used to call him back in the day, seers, right? Why was they called seers? Because they would they would see visions. You know, he'll reveal himself unto him by way of a dream or a vision, okay? Um, and that is, uh, you know, the Lord is pouring out his spirit upon all flesh now. So, different brothers and uh, sisters, okay? Right, and different brothers uh, have been um, have actually been having visions of different things that are coming of the different things that are coming to pass, you know. And uh, hey, now that's that's the precept where it says uh, uh, he shall pour his spirit upon all flesh. And now young men shall dream dreams, all right? And now and your daughters shall prophesy, okay? Now when it talks about, you know, the men, uh, uh, your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. When it talks about sons and daughters prophesying, all right? It's, it's, it's referring to, um, you know, the men, them actually preaching the word, okay? them actually preaching the word but unto the um unto the uh the the women them having visions that are are, are prophetic okay Pro, uh, to prophesy means to say before so visions 
that are displaying the will of the Heavenly Father, okay, before uh, uh, it happens, you know? And we know that those are visions, those are spiritual visions because, you know, when certain women have visions and they tell, or dreams and they tell uh, the congregation, or say uh, a man who is a prophet, okay, his woman has a dream and she tells him the dream and he breaks it down what? Via the scriptures, by the spirit. And if they line up with the scriptures, then we know that it's this is true, you know? In the dreams, you might have specific details that might have not been mentioned in the scriptures, right? And, and all the main details in, in there also to let you know that it was that it was spiritual. You know, so you know, different brothers are having different dreams. You know, I watched the video where uh, one of the brothers uh, from the UK, you know, he actually had a vision or a dream about Yahawashai, you know, and being teleported by uh, some heavenly device, okay, being teleported into a safe location, man. Okay, and and he he you know he said uh, uh, a man uh, 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 he you know you know they were partying uh, or they was at a cookout and um um it was at a cookout and uh you know the the uh, uh, basically you know as he was talking to the guy who, who was at the grill so to speak you know which um uh, I believe that could have been an angel. You know, um, but yeah, basically, uh, you know, when he when he saw uh, that man come out with that 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 uh, that white robe on, okay, you know, and, 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 and it was Yahushai, man, and and you know how he uh, basically, you know. Explain how he, he said, you know, he was hopping up and down and, you know, and like jumping and, you know, <laughs> get light on his feet, so to speak. And as he saw him, he fell to the ground and he was kissing his feet, man. Why? Because Yahweh Shai is the king of the kings and the Lord of lords, man. Okay. And, you know, that vision almost, uh, it brought, it, it actually brought that brother to tears, man. Because, hey, we, uh, hey, man, we're, 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 <laughs> We're all seeking to be saved, man. Those of us that are in the right spirit, that are in the know and in the right spirit, man, we're, we're seeking to be saved out of this, man. We're seeking to, to be saved out of our uh, affliction, okay? Saved out of our affliction, saved out of our captivity, man, and from the different dangers that have to come, you know? And Yahweh Shai is our Savior. Okay? Yahweh Shai Hamashiach is our Savior, man. Which is the true name of the Son of the Most High. Alright? He's the Savior of Israel, not the Savior of, ev of, 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 of uh, everyone. Okay? Just Israel. Okay? So, you know, with that being said... Yeah, man. So, hey, but uh, different brothers are having different dreams, you know. Uh, just recently, I had a, um, I had, a, well, I had, a, a, you know, well, I had two dreams. One of them, you know, um, and they were they were very they were very brief. You know, one of them, uh, I was actually. Uh, Standing in the city, and um, one of the uh, one of the um, I was standing in the city, and there was people that was walking past, 
uh, uh, running past me and saying uh, they were chanting something. They they kept they kept saying um, uh, nuclear. They said nuclear fallout, you know, and it was like echoing, you know, it was like echo. It was like a, almost like a call and response type of thing. It was like nuclear fallout, nuclear fallout, nuclear fallout. And I'm looking around. I'm like, what are you guys talking about nuclear fallout? And as they said that, um. There was this, uh, 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 basically, you know, there was this wave, there was this, like, this wave of wind that came, all right, a wave of wind that came, uh, from, and I could see it coming towards me, buildings was being thrashed and, 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 and broken down, and it was like a wave of wind and, 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 and like, fire, man, okay, that was coming towards me. And as that was happening, it was almost as if it was happening in slow motion too. As it was coming towards me, you know, I see us, you know, there was the I look up and there's a bright light hovering right over me, man. And as as the as the wind starts to come towards me, that 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 uh that uh, bright light which that was a chariot, you know, I feel a force start to lift me up into the chariot man and i came through through the uh, uh 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 that door that window so to speak man and and when i got up there there was other israelite men uh women and children man you know and um they were standing you know it was there was just like this giant window beneath us right and we could see uh down below man we could we could actually see the destruction that happening down below Right, so you know, and um, yeah, man, and that was that was just brief. After that, you know, I, I sort of woke, I woke up, you know, I, well, when I got on the, when I was zipped up into the chariot, and I saw all the different people in their garments, you know, which would be representative of the elect, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm hoping that I'm of that number, but I saw the different people, um. You know, I uh, when I saw those uh, different people. I immediately started to look. I immediately start to look for your Shai, man. It's like, where's your Shai? Where's he at? I, I wanted to know where he was, but you know, he wasn't on that uh, particular uh, ship. You know, that particular chariot. But yeah, man, and you know, the, the scriptures that come to mind is uh, only with thy eyes shall thou behold. The reward of the wicked. That's Psalms 91. Okay. Um, and you know. Yeah man. So hey. The, the spirit of the Lord is being poured out. On, on different brothers and, brothers and sisters man. Okay. To see. It's like, and the Lord's giving certain brothers visions. Of the destruction. Visions of the deliverance man. Visions of the, the, the hour of temptation The different things that are coming upon the earth You know And you know We're, we're all You know Of course It's going to be It's going to be a time of great trouble Okay like never was Since there was a nation As it says in Daniel uh, 12 and 1 You know So much so that The archangel Michael Is going to have to come and defend You know the elect You know Whoever that number may be and um, you know we, hey, you know we're we're all hoping to be sustained and um and um uh, uh, fortified, so to speak, and, and stable in the mind on these different times that are coming. Okay, and that's that's the importance of of, of eating eating the roll and, and, and taking in this wisdom, man, to have something to draw back on. Okay, or to remember. In the time of trouble To have comfort man You know didn't, didn't I Y'all wish I said I would not leave you comfortless man So now is the time To really uh You know <laughs> You know like uh Get wrapped up in a comforter You know like a comforter You know It's, it's something you put on your bed You know it keep, keeps you warm at night Now is the time to get real wrapped up Inside of that comforter man Okay To, 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 to get as much spiritual Sustenance 
or food as you possibly can so that when the time comes you'll be straight okay what the scripture says knowledge and wisdom shall be the stability of thy times and the strength of salvation the fear of the Lord is his treasure man and the fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge wisdom and understanding man so you know that's that's what we that's what we want man you know uh, 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 uh another um you know vision I had uh recently um you know me and my uh my woman we were uh staying inside some apartment complex and um and this was a brief one too but um basically you know uh we're staying in some apartment complex and you know some government or medical official and, a, and like soldiers were going door to door right they were going door to door knocking on people's door and, and giving them forms and slip for taking you know the c19 vaccine you know and um me i they, uh I, you know, I closed the door. I came in. I closed the door. I locked it, and um, they had a little peephole. So they came to the door, and um, basically they said, "Are you? Are you George? Uh, so like, yeah, I'm not gonna say my real name, but are you? Uh, are you such and such? Are you such and such? Does, does such and such live here?" And I said, "Yes." You know, and. Um, You know, uh, I, bas I basically said yes. And he said, uh, well, you have the option. <laughs> you have the option of, uh, uh, of um, you know, re receiving the C-19 inoculation, so to speak, the C-19 vac uh, vaccination. You have the option to receive it immediately, right now. Or you can do a walk-in at the hospital, you know, and they had a, he held up a slip. I was looking through the people. Now, there was an official standing in front, but right behind him was a, uh, a, a soldier, you know. He had his uh, his full gear on, an army, an army soldier, U.S. soldier, his full, full gear on, and he had his, he had his, uh, his rifle, or his, his gun, so to speak, in his hand, you know, ready. He was holding it, you know. Now, I don't know uh, particularly what that meant, you know, but, you know, you know, he slipped a slip under the door, and me, I said, yeah, yeah, I'll do what y'all, uh, I'll go ahead and do a, um, a, 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 a walk-in at the hospital, yeah, yeah, I'll schedule an appointment at the hospital to get my vaccination, which really, I wasn't going to do that, in my mind, I'm like, you know, what popped into mind was, be wise as serpents and harmless as doves, and that's basically how I, you know, took took the uh, the dream. You know, in the times that we're coming in, we're gonna have to be wise as serpents and harmless as doves. All right, we're gonna have to uh, righteous, <laughs> righteously yikwab, you know, these people out here, man. We're gonna have to be like yikwab, man. You know, a righteous man uh, foreseeth the evil and hideth himself, man. Yo, uh, yo, that's beautiful. Hey, man. Hey, how about Shemya Shah? It's beautiful, man. It's a full moon today. You know, halfway through the month, man. I can see the moon rising. It's, it's nice and big, man. You know, the Lord made uh, uh, many beautiful things in the universe, man. That's beautiful. You know? You know, which is nothing wrong with admiring the creation of the Lord. We just don't bow down ourselves unto it, man. You know? Because the Lord created the sun, the moons, the stars, and the trees, and the animals. The heavens and the earth and everything in them. Right? So we give him the credit. Not the not the celestial bodies, man. Alright? But, uh, that's sort of a tangent there. But, yeah, we have to be wise as serpents and harmless as doves. You know? Because a lot of stuff is going to be uh, coming at us, man. 
we're gonna be put in some trying situations, man. You know, and uh, you know, the Lord is gonna put the Spirit on His elect to maneuver. Okay, uh, through these sticky situations, man. And in a situation that seemed like you can't get out of it, the Lord is gonna have His divine intervention, intervene, man. You know, and this this could be uh, the, you know, uh, uh, maneuvering in the times that's coming up, man. You know, using wisdom. Okay, so uh, and I remember uh, uh, the brother from um, uh, the elder from uh, Dallas. I can't remember the elder's name, but he always does real, you know, powerful uh, short videos. Videos of motivation, videos in, in particular, videos that uh, of dreams that his wife had. You know, um, what is it? Uh, uh, there's one uh, vision that he had where, basically, you know, there was there was in like some abandoned building, and then, you know they walked in and they saw these two, uh, I think Edomites, who are like looked like they was having conv convulsions or whatever. You know, their eyes were black, and it was like, you know, looked like they had, like, demons on them, having, having, uh, uh, convulsions or whatever, and, um, basically, you know, they, they got, they, they, you know, they got their names, you know, they, they had, take, they had taken the chip, right, and that, they was suffering that grievous sore, you know, so that chip was basically, you know, effing them up, man, but, uh, soldiers came, and they encountered them and they asked them their names right now instead of them saying their names because they they hadn't take, taken the, the chip the mark of the beast they said the names of the people who did take it and then they you know went through a little database and they said uh you know okay they're all good they're all good to go right to check to see if they was registered you know the lord could have it happen like that man for the times that we're coming in man you know that's that's you know how, how I took the dream, you know, which was very brief. You know, be wise as serpents and harmless as doves, right? You know, uh, uh, another scripture says, uh, "Be ye be the, uh, be ye sober and vigilant, for your adversary, the devil, okay, as as a roaring lion, seek uh, uh, walketh about as a roaring lion, seeking whom he may devour." Man, now that's 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 you know. That's uh, uh, that could, uh, talking about the spiritual demon Satan, right? But then the physical counterpart, he, uh, you know, Eve. He, he he in that time he's gonna be seeking whom he can devour, man. It's like it. He's gonna be seeking whom he can devour, man. Okay, but we're gonna have to. Really, hey, man, we gotta we're gonna we have to watch this devil, man. We have to watch him, man. You know. That's why the scriptures say never trust thine enemy, man, because this devil's sly. You gotta keep a lookout for him, man. And you know, that's why in these times, man, it's good for us to uh, you know, watch the news more and more. You know, for the one for the to see the prophecies coming to pass. Because the, these prophecies have to come to pass in order for the kingdom of Israel to be set up. You know? One for the, to see the prophecies coming to pass, and then two to see how this devil might move, and then how we might need to move, man. You know, of course, everything is going to be faith in the Most High ultimately, but you know, it's still wise to have certain things set up. You know, the Lord may have, may make it to where you can use that. You know, for the upcoming famine. And food shortages, okay. People, uh, you know, you might be evicted from your home, or you might have to leave your home or flee. You know, be as pilgrims upon the earth. So it would be good, you know, to have, you know, a, a tent. A tent could come in handy. You know, you could get it. You know, you could buy a tent. You could use it. You know, the Lord could have it to where you're able to use it, or you could not use it. The Lord could just have you ducking and dodging. In um, in uh, uh, abandoned buildings and whatnot, you know, having food materialized before you, man. All right, or sending the angel to give you food, or sending the angel to lead you through danger, man. You know, uh, uh, Psalms ninety one says what? 
uh, um, uh, 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 and he shall give the angels charge over thee to keep thee in all thy ways, and they shall, uh, and they shall gather gather you up, you know, uh, lest I dash thy foot upon the stone, man. So the angels, you know, basically are protecting us in that time, man. All right, we continue on to the end. The angels will the, will, will, will protect us. The Lord will send the, the holy angels. All right, to guide us and protect us, man. All right, you know, you know. I just wanted to do a, a, a real quick in transit, you know, while I'm out, you know, doing deliveries or whatever. And um, you know, Lord willing, um, this was uh, edifying to uh, uh, the elect, okay. And uh, shalom.